Doug and Ken are at points D and K, respectively. They are 100 meters apart. They see a perfect tree for their treehouse at point T. If Doug sees the tree at angle KDT equals 53 degrees, and Ken sees the tree at angle DKT equals 28.5 degrees, how far is the tree from Ken? I'm going to begin by drawing a diagram of what these boys are up to. We have points D and K, and they are 100 meters apart. And then we see uh, a tree, some tree at point T, somewhere over here, T. And so that is going to make a triangle. Connecting those three points makes a triangle. We're told that the angle KDT is 53 degrees. KDT, that's this angle right here, 53 degrees. So I'll put that in there because drawing a diagram really helps us to understand what's going on. We also have uh, angle DKT is 28.5 degrees. So DKT, this angle here, is 28.5 degrees. And remember when we're doing this, we're talking about degrees here, not radians. So make sure that your calculator is in degrees mode. We want to find, ultimately, this length. How far is Ken from the tree? That's what we're looking for. Okay, we're going to use the law of sines. And that law of sines says that the sine of an angle divided by the opposite side is equal to the sine of another angle divided by its opposite side length. So first let's find this uh, angle DTK. Well, angle DTK is going to equal that 180 degrees of the triangle minus what's being used up here, or minus the other angles. Minus 53 degrees for one angle, minus 28.5 degrees for the other angle, and that equals angle DTK equals 98.5 degrees. All right, I'll label that 98.5 degrees. Sounds a little like a radio station. Radio station bringing you all the triangles. Okay, back to the to the the problem at hand. We want to find this side length. Well, I'm going to say that the sine of angle 53 degrees divided by its opposite side, that is the length KT, equals the sine of this 98.5 degrees divided by the opposite side of 100 meters. And the reason I'm using that is because I don't know the side length opposite of 28.5 degrees. Um, and what I'm trying to find is, is this KT. So I'm using what, I, what is given to me and, uh, and then just putting it in the appropriate place so that we can have just one unknown. And that's the length KT. Okay, uh, solving this equation then you would say uh, multiply by KT and, and then each side by KT and then multiply by 100 and then divide by 98 point or sine of 98.5 degrees and you would get KT equals 100 multiplied by sine of 53 degrees divided by sine of 98 point five degrees and type that all into your calculator when you do that make sure you put parentheses after the the degrees as in the numerator before you put the division sign or you can do it step by step you can just take sine of 53 degrees and then multiply it by 100 and then divide it by sine of 98.5 degrees that either way is fine okay the distance that Ken is from the tree drum roll 80 point seven five meters 
I know what you might be thinking. Why didn't these boys just walk it off? Well, what if there was a big lake there? Let's draw a lake there. And, and that was the problem. That's why they couldn't walk it off. So just for example. Okay, there's a, a distance, 80.75 meters, using the law of signs.